<laughs> well, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> good morning. <laughs> oh, so this morning what we're going to show is uh, some of Daniel's. So you can't say it, huh? Bus. I can't say good morning, good morning, good morning. You wanted me to say it. I can't say it. Um, so Daniel is um, a single guy out here on the road. His bus is really beautiful. He, he is a lived, prince of a guy. Oh, just as kind and nice mm -hmm. as a guy as you could ever find. And he lived in Manhattan in New York for I think around 33, 33 years, years or something. Went there yeah. for five, stayed yeah. for 33. I think so. <laughs> and so uh, quite a difference for him Being, leaving the big city of New York yes. and coming out on the open road to the desert. We're glad he's Arizona. out here. He's we a, are. He's a great guy. He is. Okay. Are this we is, live? We are live now. Oh, no. Now I'm going to clam up. Um, I was on to showing you my closet. I love my closet. This is the. This is Daniel. Hi, Daniel. And yes. the name of your bus? I don't have a name. Okay, not a name yep. yet, but boy, Working it is it. cute. It is so cute. We're gonna have to go back and start at the beginning. That is a nice sized nice, closet. Big closet with That's, woven shelves in yeah. the back. Um, oh, that is great. The drawers underneath are three feet deep. They go way under. Oh, yes, two, man. Two big drawers. Great storage area. Um, I guess we should just, well, this I, this idea I got from Wonderboom. Uh-huh. It's the refrigerator since the winter. Oh, yes. Out and Fantastic. This, this can be freezer and they can both be, right now they're both refrigerator. Oh, that's super. Beautiful work. Yeah. Did you do the work on this? I did not. I had the most amazing help uh, with the guys from um, Blue Ridge Conversions, the guys and Stacy. Absolutely. that Amazing people. And some people would know uh, them yes. because they built the bus for Justin Rhodes. For Justin Rhodes. That was mm -hmm. one of the first big projects. Yeah, right. it's uh, it's Jeff Quinton. Quinton's the son of yeah. Stacy and Jeff. And, and then there was Chris, who's a guy in the neighborhood also who helped. Who was, they, they have all the skill required and How they were cute. so sweet because they allowed me to be present for the whole pretty much the whole build well but it is amazing work they did a great job yes they did i spent a couple of years designing it and i think i did a good enough job that they didn't say no to anything i asked so you for. stepped up on your wheel well yep there's the wheel well uh-huh um bedroom is right through here Oh yes, how cute! Mm -hmm. Nice, man. You bedroom. do a good job. It's a uh, very, very comfortable. It's, uh, it's really, and that's a hatch that goes up to the roof deck. Oh wow! Yep. Yeah, we don't have enough room for a roof deck with all the solar panels right. we have. And there's my oh bath. shower and yeah, and your stool. All oh, that is great. Yep. What a super job! And I can stand up. I can stand up at a normal height in here once I'm in here. Oh, that is great. <laughs> I'm lucky I'm not so tall. And it looks kind of a little like a little hobbit house yeah, door. That was Stacy's idea. Stacy Jameson. We were all scratching our heads trying to figure out what to do with the roof angle and the bathroom door. Uh-huh. And it worked she out. Said, Why don't you just cut it round? Uh-huh. And we were all like, oh my god, that's brilliant. Isn't this beautiful? We're kind of doing this backwards. We're backwards, doing it kind yeah. of from the back to the front. Back through. But I'll tell you what, he, you guys did a marvelous job. What a good design. Yeah, what a good I, design. Spent, I spent a lot of energy in designing. Um, didn't cost me much but my time and it was Man, It is amazing, fun. Daniel. And the amazing thing is Daniel's a Yankee. I'm a Yankee. I'm <laughs> born and raised in Massachusetts. Yep. And we love you to pieces. Surprising, right? <laughs> Surprising. <laughs> Four K dwarf stove. Oh yes, and it yeah. is. These are the cutest stoves. I'll yep. tell you, they are so nice. Works very well. Kept me alive in Maine. I'll tell you what, they'll keep, they'll keep this bus warm. That thing yeah. will. Yeah. And a beautiful desk here. This desk I've had for many years, and I had to cut uh, an eight-inch section off the end so that it would fold flat against the wall. Mm -hmm. But I can pull it off the wall and move it into the room. Put two more legs on, and then this light. I can hang over the table in the middle and I can seat six people around the table. That is so unique. I love that. Yeah. It's cozy. I mean, it's very tight, but but I love good it. Friends. <laughs> wow, how cool is that? Boy, Daniel, thank you. And I love books. So, you know, oh man. Yeah. I, I fall in love with this uh these bookcases. Yeah. When we downsized, the uh -huh. only thing I really couldn't downsize, Daniel, is I just couldn't get rid of my books. 
I got rid of so, so many. It was very painful, long I, process. I am paying a hundred dollars a month for Store them? storing books right wow. now. I probably have you know thirty boxes or forty boxes of books wow. at least. Wow, but, man, it's just hard to let go of them. Yeah, I, it is. Just the feel, the smell. I know yeah. electronics are great, but. I have a nothing Kindle like also, a but there's nothing. Right. These are my prize, you know, my favorites. I have right. to hold them. Ah, uh, yeah, you mm. got to hold them. And I've got one real old book. It's yeah. 1885. Oh. And uh, a lady, when I pulled it out uh, yesterday, this lady said, can I smell of it? Yes. So she got, a few of got it and smelled yeah. of it. Yeah. Uh -huh. um, I wonder if I should show you the, the garage in the back. Sure, that would be great. Let me go. We're going backwards here, yeah. so we're going to back up <laughs> and... Uh, we're going to take a look here, this. and there's the driving area. And by the way, we do have a one gorgeous oh. sunset going on here. Wow. Is this not beautiful, Daniel? Oh. That is really... That is moving. It is powerful. Boy. And then over here you can see there's all the lights of um, actually, that Ehrenberg. is Ehrenberg, yeah. yes. A little town right on the California, yeah. Arizona yeah. desert. Oh, that's gorgeous. Okay, let's take a look. You don't have a name for your bus yet. I don't. But it is a beautiful kind of a steel blue. It's almost a blue-gray. Yeah, people see blue, it's a, people see gray. Yeah. It's a 2001 Thomas Freightliner. Uh-huh. 5.9 Cummins engine, Allison Series 2000 transmission. Great bus. 13 foot deck on the roof. Oh wow. Look at this deck guys. Huge deck up here. And then this is his garage in the back. In the garage, yeah. So I'm telling you, if you haven't been on the road like this, this garage is invaluable. Yeah. Mine is underneath my bus, uh -huh. but his, he just Here's built a garage right back here on the back. Yep. And uh, uh, he has his batteries, Battleborn batteries. Mm -hmm. My goodness, what a beautiful mm -hmm. area for, guys gotta have a little bit of a garage. I gotta, yeah, uh, tools and climbing gear and what have you. This is a spare solar panel here. Oh wow! Um, uh -huh. That door is the door into the bathroom. Oh wow! So when I'm through with my business and uh -huh. spread my peat moss, I can reach out that door and scoop and another. redo it. Yeah, redo it. That's awesome. Yep. yep. That is great. I'm going to back up here so I can see this a little better. Wow! Thank you so much, Daniel, for showing me your bus. You're welcome. It's a pleasure. And they're saying, 
Viva Vila Viva Vila Viva Vila Viva Vila Viva Viva Vila Viva Vila Viva 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 so did we. <laughs> we, said, we sang that song in school. <laughs> we sang that song in school, she said. Microphone. There you go. We have to have the microphone.